Hey everyone, my name is Roberto Aguirre Sacasa. I am the Chief Creative Officer of Archie Comics Publishing, and I am the showrunner of, of Riverdale, the uh, Archie show that Warner Brothers produces and airs on the CW. And I wanted to start by talking a little bit about the show, but I really wanted to start by thanking everyone who has tuned in and watched the show. We really wouldn't be here without the support of you guys who turn in, tune in every week. I think the first season, we have 13 episodes, a lot of which is about uh, solving the, the, the murder of who killed Jason Blossom. That is a mystery that we do solve by the end of the season, and we, we also tease uh, who our big bad for season two might be. It's someone uh, that has uh, long, uh, deep ties to the Archie universe. It's definitely a character people know. I think it's a character people won't see coming. I also want to talk a little bit about the Riverdale comic book, which is a really, really exciting thing. You know, a lot of times comic book companies launch companion books when there's a TV spin-off or a TV ver version of a show, they, they launch a comic book that's sort of a um, an adaptation of the episodes. And I, and I want to kind of be clear that we're, though this book exists in the Riverdale, in the CW Riverdale's universe, they are not adaptations of episodes. If anything, they're, they're uh, stories that we wanted to tell on the series, but either couldn't for budget reasons or time reasons or 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 things like that, but the, but they are new stories set in the CW Riverdale world. the The last thing I want to talk to you guys about is the thing that's nearest and dearest to my heart, which is Afterlife with Archie and the Chilling Adventures of Sabrina. The books are not canceled; they are coming back. Robert is almost finished drawing uh, issue seven, which is a mega issue. I think it's like. 35 pages. It's almost a, two issues together. And Francesco is is drawing issue 11, which is also a big oversized issue. I've been working kind of around the clock on Riverdale, the show, which has eaten up a lot of my time. Uh, but I'm getting caught up on the comic book writing during our little break that we have in the writer's room. And trying to get um, Afterlife 11 and 12 done so we can finish the second arc, Betty R.I.P., which I think is, it's a sad story to be telling, but it's a, it's a fun story as well. And then working on Sabrina getting our second arc, which is called Witch War, really shifting into high gear. They're truly beautiful works of art, both those books, and Francesco and Robert are doing incredible work on it. And, and I have to say that the delays are mostly from my end because I've been working on Riverdale and giving that 150%. It's such an important uh, endeavor for us. And I, and, and, but nearest and dearest to my heart are Afterlife with Archie and Chilling Adventures of Sabrina. And, and those books are going to be uh, back on the schedule and coming out. So that's, that's the update from um, Riverdale West. We're here in, on the West Coast in my office. Um, uh, uh, and uh, more big news to come on the live action side of things and uh, more big announcements to come on the comic book side of things as well. But, but thank you as always for being such fans and such supporters of the, of the books and the TV show. This is kind of the most exciting uh, uh, time to be an Archie fan, I think, because you've got the digest, you've got the, the relaunch books, you've got the horror uh, universe, and now we've got Archie live action with Riverdale and hopefully, like I said, uh, some big announcements coming for uh, new projects in those universes. But but really, thank you uh, for being such good fans. It means all the difference. Bye and see you this summer in San Diego.